Hi everyone, my name is Bogen Shongwan. And my name is Richard Lins, and we're here to present our lab project under the School of Electrical and Information Engineering at the University of the Big Bartistan. The title of our project is Characterizing Double Cavity Partial Discharges. A partial discharge is an electrical spark that does not completely bridge the gap between electrodes. There are four kinds of partial discharges. Corona discharge occurs around sharp high voltage conductors. It is normally visible in the form of a purple glow. Surface discharge occurs at the boundary of different insulation material. Internal discharge occurs due to cavities within the solid or liquid electrical insulation. Electrical treeing is a continuous impact of discharges in solid insulation forming a discharge channel. Solid insulation with impurities and airfill gaps, cavities, can be found in solid insulation of medium and high voltage generators, motors, power cables. Insulation defects are a result of manufacturing, handling and other faulty processes. Under power cable operations, cavities experience localized electrical stress, partial discharges. These discharges degrade insulation by pitting and creating electrical trees. Insulation deterioration continues, called aging, until insulation failure and complete breakdown. This results in unscheduled downtime, power cuts and damage of electrical equipment. Polyethylene sheets were used as test samples. The defected polyethylene disc was sandwiched between two healthy discs. The resultant specimen was clamped tightly between two electrodes and is then immersed in mineral oil to avoid surface discharges. This circuit represents the standard partial discharge test circuit. This is the practical experimental setup used for partial discharge measurement in the high voltage laboratory. The voltage is slowly increased using the variac until partial discharges are observed in the partial discharge measuring device. The results are then stored in the computer for further analysis. Electric field simulation using firm software was observed for single and double cavities. The gap between the double cavities was varied to produce electric field magnitude graphs. The electric field magnitude of double cavities exceeded single cavity. The field magnitude increases with decreasing gap length between the double cavities. The passes represent the cavity discharge activities for the laboratory samples. The single cavity resulted in fewer charge pulse rates at a distinct position and magnitude, whereas the double cavities had a high charge pulse rate over a wider space and bigger charge magnitude. There is a clear pattern distinction for single versus double cavities, as they also differ in charge cloud clusters and the magnitude they occur at. Therefore, cavities in close proximity to each other degrade insulation much faster. The results from this investigation can be used in condition monitoring and maintenance of high voltage equipment.